income relief for those who've lost their jobs and a point system to restrict access to foreign workers in certain occupations. These are among nine recommendations made by a task force to support professionals, managers and executives, or PMEs, and protect their jobs. Clara Lee reports. The task force was put together to address challenges faced by PMEs, particularly those aged between 40 and 60. After consulting more than 10,000 stakeholders, including union leaders and business leaders over the last 12 months, it has come up with nine recommendations under four key thrusts. The first is to improve workplace fairness. Suggestions include a point system for reviewing employment pass applications. It should consider a range of factors beyond just qualification and salary. These include whether the employer has been hiring local workers and the diversity of nationalities within the company. The task force is also calling for a national framework to provide income relief to those who have lost their jobs, as well as an additional tier of support for union members and older workers. The third thrust is to ensure more hiring opportunities for vulnerable mature PMEs. Recommendations include short-term salary support for companies. Skills upgrading programs could also be strengthened by supporting causes to help local PMEs take on leadership roles. The task force also suggests incorporating training needs into curricula offered by institutes of higher learning. These nine recommendations under the four trusts are the direct feedback from the PMEs. Raw feedback, some with a level of angst because of lived experiences, some with suggestions on constructive uh, suggestions of how we can do better. One such contributor is 60-year-old Chong Kam Hong. As an education consultant for a culinary academy, he says older employees can become an economic asset. The mature PMEs are usually armed with years of job experience and with good work attitude and it will be a waste not to effectively tap on this pool of uh, labour force. But most important point is that um, we encourage uh, mature age uh, PMEs we actually continue to upskill, reskill, or learn to relearn and learn multiple skill sets to stay relevant in the marketplace. After she was retrenched, 50 year old Cassandra Ng took on a temporary job and is now completing exams to get her real estate license. Currently, I'm actually taking the role in Temasek Poly as a safe distancing ambassador job. It's actually less stressful. Uh, I think it's fun because you're actually interacting with the kids here. It makes you more youthful and vibrant. The task force has submitted its recommendations to the Manpower Ministry for consideration. NTUC hopes they'll be put into action by next year.